Hey guys, this is Tiamat Ruler back with another episode of my Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Hexlock. And this time I have my good friend, a wild chicken Rita, here with me. Hello everyone. Why can you are just you can you just say Chikorita one more time? A wild Chikorita. <laughs> it sounded like you were about to say a wild Chikorita. Maybe uh, I don't know what I <laughs> Anyway, hello everyone. But uh, last episode, we left off after defeating the Snowpoint City Gym. So that means we can use Rock Climb outside of battle, which I taught to Tay because I did not want to teach it to Pride. Eh, he taught me Rock Smash, you know. Yeah, no, no, Rock Climb. Rock Climb. He bought me Rock Climb. He not yes. by me. He taught me Rock Climb. It's like a 90 damage move that, with 90 accuracy, that has the chance to confuse, so. Really? Rock Climb can confuse? Yes. I didn't, I see, I forgot about that. And then here's the dialogue. I, this, I, uh, the Random Water Trades episode that went up earlier should have explained everything. I tried to put this up on Tuesday, but I didn't record correctly, so I do know what's going on. Anyways, Hydros has an exclamation mark. You're not getting away with this, Team Galactic. That's a female. Um, I hate doing female voices. <laughs> oh, are you finished already? Oh, thank you. <laughs> your Pokemon are bad, but you're laughably weak. You honestly thought you could save the Pokemon of the lake? And become the Pokemon champion? Dream on, little kid. But ew, it's so cold here. Let's go back to the Veilstone HQ. Oh, don't I know you? We met in Eterna City. Listen, Team Galactic is going to do something huge for everyone's sake. That's why you should keep out of Team Galactic's way. Don't come whining about poor Pokemon and other trivial junk like that. Don't waste your time coming to our HQ in Veilstone. And now, if you'll excuse me. I thought she was going to say, I'm headed to Veilstone. I was like, if <laughs> yeah. you say Veilstone one more time. Yeah, that's right. I couldn't do anything against Team Galactic. That Pokemon called Uxie, it was suffering. I'm going to get tougher. It's not about winning or losing. That's not good enough. I have to be stronger. It's not enough to just want to be the most powerful trainer ever. It takes honest effort and a determined heart. And he just walks away. <laughs> um, when I first did this, I just surfed around in here not knowing what was in here. Um, obviously, this is my first encounter here. It's a Waylord, but I already have a water type, so. But I love Waylord. He can bounce, and he's cute. I'm just going to razor leaf it. Goodbye. I'm so proud. So that was my first encounter for here. I was hoping to get to the grass because I know there's some good stuff here. I already have that. Mm. Okay, let's be able to run away, please. I don't know if there's anything here. There is not. I didn't check that, actually. Magneton. Magneton. That would have been interesting. That could have been cool. Yeah, because you don't have an electric type. I do not. Exactly, that would have been... Except it would have been another Pokemon weak against fire, but... Yeah, that's true. Steel Wing? I don't even think I have anything that can learn Steel Wing. Mm, I don't know. I don't think Yonmega can learn it. I know there's also... Jolteons. Yep, there's a Jolteon. And there's Swallows in here, I believe. Oh, there's Tangles too. I didn't know about that. But, hmm. yeah, there's Swallows in here, too. Um, if I would have had a choice that I probably could have, would have actually picked, it probably would have been Swallow, because I don't have an actual team member that's flying type. I just have my Fly Bitch. <laughs> just a Fly Bitch. Parasect no was my original first encounter on this route that I couldn't catch. <laughs> that I did, or that I could have caught, but I didn't, because, you know, I already have a Grass type and a Bug type. Delcaddy, no. I wouldn't have caught that anyways. So you have a normal type. And I don't know why I surfed all the way back, because I can just, you know, 
fly to where I need to go. Because I have a fly bitch. And it took me a little bit to figure out where exactly Veilstone was. I know exactly where it is now, so I don't have to waste time figuring out where it's at. I think I kind of remember where it's at. Well, I just flew there, so... Oh, I'm just, like, trying to picture the map in my head, and I think I kind of remember where it's at. Oh, did I go by too fast on the map? No, you're good. But... Since I've already done this, I know where to go. I go up here. And I talk to this guy. There, would you look at those antennae? I don't know what, what they do, but those are some mighty impressive antennae. Antennae, whatever you say. Hey, it's you! I bet you don't remember me, but I sure remember you. Because of you, they took my Clefairy away. My partner called it quits and went back to his old country. Well, I know nothing. I don't know anything about any storage key. Oh, looker. Aha, you leave this to me. The storage key for entering the Team Galactic hideout I have right here. A frontal assault is not po it is not possible. His English is very weird. A frontal assault it is not possible. Why don't you just say a frontal assault is not possible? <laughs> Anyways, but we can but we can enter their hideout. Well, will you enter the hideout? You have your reasons, yes? Yes. Very well. Inside the Team Galactic warehouse, he will. We will meet there. Prepare the best you can. I shall join you shortly. Get out of my way, old fart. <laughs> You're not really that old, but only like three hundred and six. Actually, there's an item over here. I know it's useless, but it's gonna bug me if I just leave a pokeball. Yeah, I, I know. Did, what it I is. did the same thing. I already know what it is because I picked it up earlier. It's stupid awakening. Never know, I may need that awakening if it, something puts me asleep. So. Come up here. Go into the warehouse. And he comes back. Ah, oh, hello, I've kept you waiting. I will use this storage key I have obtained from the Team Galactic. Kerchunk. Yes, it is opened. I will go on ahead, my friend. Do not expose yourself to danger. Oh, I will expose myself all I want. Waiting for you to make a joke. Taylor? Hmm. He said, do not expose yourself to danger. And I said, oh, I will expose myself all I want. And I was waiting for you to make a joke, and you didn't. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I think my, my, my headset must have cut out for a second or something. Team Galactic will set free all Pokemon, all of nature. Ha 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 ha. Team Galactic will then own it all. Oh, you don't battle All me. of it. I don't know if you've realized, but the Jupiter lady I talked to mm -hmm. um, that you did the voice for was actually the person I battled in the episode that you were originally in. I thought so. So. I just have a thing for coming around when uh, Jupiter is in the storyline. Yeah. Well, what, what have we here? A trainer who's lost their way? Whoops, you can hear my phone. Sorry. It's all TARDIS! Too, too far away for me to turn off, so hopefully it doesn't go off again. Uh, Golbat. Not something that Tay wants to stay in against. No. Oh, of course you poison me. Ooh, Just that's annoying. Ice Fang. And Water Pulse. Goodbye. Now I go back into my bag here. Super potion. And antidote. And that should be good. And there's an item up here. It's a lepa berry. And there's another person here. What with that creepy Charon? I don't know how you pronounce that. Charon? Charon! Is it Charon? I don't yeah. know. And a kid like you around, the HQ's not the same anymore. Like you characters changed the, well, character of the place. I had so much trouble reading that line before, just because of the way it's written. I actually did really good that time. Um, how did I do this before? I think we just went to Gluttony. Water pulse. Goodbye. Murkrow. Nope. Staying in. Ice Fang. 
I like to keep my teams even, which is why I am putting out Gluttony against the Flying types instead of uh, Wrath. But I also like to make sure my team is healed up. No. That's the issue with the speed up button. <laughs> Start clicking on stuff you don't mean to. Yeah. I believe Wrath has the experience share too. That's also why I'm not uh putting it out right now yeah no i get you i'm a team galactic member but i don't even have a pokemon i'm the gruntiest of the grunts it's my fault though if i still don't know how the warp p panels connect and if i remember these warp panels are like super simple i think this one's a female um yeah it is who do you think you are death Desecrating the halls of our HQ. It's so hard to tell between the sprites. We just have, like, slightly longer hair. Mm -hmm. Rock climb. Razor leaf. Goodbye. Like, I, I'm not, like, underleveled for this at all. No, I don't think so. And I, have, I haven't grinded for a long time. Really? Since, like, episode two. Oh. Jeez. Yeah. Yeah, you're at a decent level, I think. Yeah, see, these warp panels are so simple. I'm going to go up here first because there's items up here. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to go up there first. Okay. I'm, like, this close to getting my promotion to commander. I'll impress our great boss by making you my newest trophy. I'm going to be your trophy? Mm -mm. So what, are you going to cut off my head? That's what I was just going to say. They're going to cut off your head and put it in, like, a little box. Put, put it on, it on display. Yeah. Display it and just carry it around. Crow gunk. Pride. Fake out. I love fake out. Cut. Goodbye, crow gunk. Murkrow. Send out gluttony again. And ice fang. One hit. No issues. Awesome. Wait, no, I didn't want to go up there yet because you need the key to get into a door to get an item. <laughs> yep. Hey, now, our HQ is state of the art facility. Is a state of the art facility. A snot nosed kid like you ought to keep your du dirty hands to yourself. Your duty hands to yourself? Rock climb, razor leaf, that seems to be a decent combination. I remember bringing out uh, Envy for this just to use Night Slash and one hit the Kadabra. Because dark type move. I would have brought out another one where I would have brought out Weave uh, Wrath, but Wrath is, Wrath is like the highest level right now, so thief okay to get into master cyrus's speech uh where was it now at the galactic veilstone building that much i'm sure about go in through the door beside the reception counter i think it was uh what did i do with that key anyway where's it gone Why are you telling me where to go okay i'm just gonna open this door because i can I'm going to head back, because I know going up those stairs brings me to another door I can open. If that makes sense. Where'd Taylor go? I'm here. Sorry. Okay. The locked door is only open with a special key. Now, if I was a comedy relief sort of bad guy, I'd tell you. But I really don't know. Mm. Thanks for being helpful, dude. You're too young to understand the changing times. Stand aside and let Team Galactic shape the future. Uh, Stunky. Goodbye, Stunky. That was easy enough. Mm -mm, there you go. I was kind of worried about poison type, but... Oh my god, stop moving! He just kept moving away from me. I don't know if you saw that. Yeah, I did. Intruder alert! There's something 
There's something smelly about you. Oh, well, thanks. I mean, I don't want to keep you in here. <laughs> I mean, what do, what do I smell like? Cheese. 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 Why cheese? And grapes. Grapes? Mm hmm. Well, I'm gonna fake out this stunky and then cut it, and that's gone. Did I need to heal anybody? Oh, okay, yes, I did. Just because it's a hex lock, I am very uh, picky about how low I let my Pokemon go. At this point, especially. The door is locked. Yes, I'll use my key. And here's the item I was talking about. Silverwind. So it was important for me to get it because now I can go to my bag, find Silverwind, which is like down here. Yep. It's a bug type move. And Envy does not have any bug type moves right now. And I don't like Uproar. That's, ow! That's what I originally did. I replaced Uproar with Silverwind because I don't like Uproar because it locks you into it for three turns if that makes sense yeah i get i get you and so and solar wind is a stab move so it's still going to be 90 damage there you go yeah that'll be good did i went i went the wrong way <laughs> wrong way i hate war panels i'm so bad at them no it's just that i went that way instead of oh hi kitty so everybody who is watching this is seeing my kitty be all lovey. But uh, as of recording this, I said this in my Random Wonder Trades episode, but today is kind of a special day because it is our friend's birthday. So if you want to, go tell her happy birthday. Our Twitter is at Rainbow2Mandy. I don't know. I said that in my Random Wonder Trades episode too because I felt like it. So. Go tell her happy birthday. Go cheer her up. I know, I know, I know, I know, I will. Not while I was telling everybody who watches, just go tell her happy birthday, even if it's late. Just yeah, no, nice. everyone goes, everyone goes sob as a birthday present. Yes. And no, I don't want to heal again. I just healed. <laughs> okay, so now I have to go back up here. We are about 17 minutes in. Go into on the here. road again. Going Ow. to on the road again. Yes. Open the door, and then we go up here. Oh, okay, cat. Let's not start crawling underneath my cords and stuff. Okay. Having fun scamping around our HQ, you sneaky intruder. Your trail blade. Your trailblazing will go out in a blaze of glory right now. I don't give the grunts too big of a variation of voices. I apologize if you don't like that, but they're grunts. Oh my god, this is the one that is annoying because of Confuse Ray. Okay. Okay, good. I got rid of it. Oh yeah, he has another Golbat. I'm gonna go ahead and go to bag real quick. HP restore. Moo Moo Milk. Eh, uh, yeah, see, that's what I, I hate about Golbats. Confuse Ray every other freaking turn whenever you're not confused. But thankfully, Gluttony fought right through the confusions this time. <laughs> yeah, that's true. You should be tired out by now. It's Team Galactic's turn to shine. I forgot that was a female. <laughs> Another Golbat. I hate Golbats. I do too. And see, at C, Confuse Ray. Fuck your dick. Oh my god, and Poison. <laughs> oh no. Uh, That's annoying. Uh, yeah, just a bit. He needs a potion. And Mean Look, so I can't even switch out. Oh. Um, Careful. Where... I'll be good. I'll be good. Antidote. As long as I can fight through the potion, or through the confusion. There. I remember the first time I went through this. That <sighs> sucks. Yeah. You're gonna have to snap out of confusion, hopefully. Yep. 
the, the first time I did this, one of these goal bats, it, the confusion just, I kept, like this, I had to keep healing. Yeah, it happens sometimes. It sucks, though. I'm not risking that. That is probably within crit range. Yeah. Okay, Ice Fang. I, and I'm poisoned again. Oh my goodness. The, the, these are the battles that I hate because you waste so many items. Yeah. But you gotta do what you gotta do, man. You gotta let your Pokemon survive. Yep, and I can't switch out. So. Um, especially in a hex lock, you can't you can't let them die, because you can't replace them. And, oh my god! <laughs> oh my, that's that's annoying. This was not this bad before, but I can't switch out this time. So, and I'm not gonna risk losing him. There we go. Thank you for using air cutter that time. Ice Fang, thank you. Frozen! Thank God. Hound hour, no. You can you can kill a hound hour with water pulse. Okay, so that was Okay, so this battle up ahead is gonna be the one that I regret. That I or that I don't like. Um, but I don't necessarily want to do it any differently than I did it, because I know I can do it, and, uh, okay. I won't let you disrupt our research. This is for Team Galactic. Poor God, too. This is the one where I get worried. Okay, Confusion, thank you. There we go. That one I didn't have to worry about this time. That Porygon learns, uh, or can use Signal Beam, so. Bug type versus Grass type got gets kind of worrisome. Um, I'm gonna, I taught it Body Slam over Synthesis the first time, so. I'm actually gonna go in here, though, and go into my Pokemon and take off the Experience Share from Wrath and give it to Envy because we haven't been using Envy as much just because there's not haven't been as many chances and I like to keep them even yeah I get what you mean like Josh is has told me that he's been he's like jealous of the way I can keep my teams even leveled so well An old Amber, that one, not so useful unless I get a good Pokemon from it if I try to revive it. I just know there's items over here instead of... Actually, I think... Is there another item over here? I don't remember. No, there wasn't. Okay. There was another room I was thinking of. I will be going back to later once I go through here. Okay, dialogue time. Mm. Psst, here, over here, this gathering of the Team Galactic. What is the meaning of it? Why does he always say of the Team Galactic? Fellow members of Team Galactic, hear me. My name, as I appear to you today, is Cyrus. The world of ours is a crude this world of ours is a crude one, and a world that is incomplete. It has been and always will be a struggle to survive in this world. We humans and Pokemon are likewise incomplete. Because we are all so lacking, we fight, we maim, it is ugly. I hate the incompleteness. We that we are all incomplete. I hate it with my entire body and being. The world should be complete. The world must change. I'm getting some static from your end. I don't know what. Taylor? Taylor? Hmm. Okay, I was getting some static from your end. I'm not sure what it was. Hello? Hello? Taylor? Oh, whoops. 
Hold on, guys. Taylor. Hello. Well, I don't know what is going on with Taylor, but hopefully she'll be back with us soon. Anyways, then who will change it? Me, Cyrus, and Team Galactic. Yes, all of you. Together we poured over myths and exposed their secrets. Together we captured legendary Pokemon. And now, Team Galactic has obtained the energy to change the world. The power of dreams is within our grasp. Understand it, fellow members. My long-held long -held dream world is on the verge of becoming reality. All those headed to Mount Coronet and those who remain here. Though our missions may differ, our hearts beat as one. Let there be glory for Team Galactic. Roar! Master Cyrus is the greatest! Woo! So that was Cyrus, the boss of Team Galactic. Quite the performance, no? Mesmerizing for one only 27 years old. But to make a world for Team Galactic and none other, it is preposterous, so much so that it makes my head spin. A new world? What is that? And what is this incomplete world? Very well. To investigate such matters is the job of the International Police, of which I am a member of in good stead, and it is my job, therefore. We shall part ways here. Take extra care, my friend. Alright, which means we get to keep going on through here. Uh, I don't know what these beds are for. Cause... And sure the bed is unoccupied before getting into it. <laughs> uh, Team Galactic Nap Room. Ensure the, ensure the bed is occupied bef unoccupied before getting into it. No, I did not want to go back. Um, yep, this is what I wanted to do. It's a double battle. Are you enjoy Are you enjoying your unescorted, unauthorized, and unsettling tour of Team Galactic HQ? Hey there, tr little trainer. You're famous among Team Galactic. The order has been issued. We get a promotion if we put you down. Are you there, Taylor? Her mic stopped working. Hopefully she can get it back up. I don't know. Um, we're going to go ahead and body slam the crow gunk and fake out the stunky. You had to poison jab me. You had to. Taylor? Yeah, I'm not hearing anything yet. I'm just hearing weird sounds. I don't know what's going on. You've never had an issue with your headset before. This is weird. I didn't see what happened there. I don't know if that's stunky, like, self-destructed or what. <laughs> but... I'm gonna go ahead and rock smash the glammy out, get that out of the way. Huh. That's not good. I don't know what would cause that. I'm not good with that kind of stuff, unfortunately. And everything's plugged in correctly? Oh, no, I'm in the right place.
haven't touched anything. That's really odd. Huh. I know these two things lead to items. A Reaper Cloth. And I know there was something, if I look here, an X Special Defense. Okay, that wasn't useful. And then there's an item right here, an Ice Heal. Which could come in handy. I hope Taylor is able to come back. Because that's kind of disappointing. That we don't get to have Taylor in the call for the rest of this. Use the galactic key. Yes, I will open it. So, you've come. You heard my speech, I take it. <laughs> a big lie, of course. It's true, insofar as my intention is to create a new world. But that world isn't for the likes of Team Galactic. I seek an entirely new world solely for myself. If not, it could never be the complete and perfect world. I've see, you've seen my minions of Team Galactic. You yourself must know that they are uniformly useless and incomplete. I know why you're here. I can sense it in you. It's about Uxi, Mesprit, and Azov, correct? You want to save them. I no, lo no longer have any need for them. I am finished with them. If your heart aches to save them, go right ahead. I couldn't care less. It will save me the trouble of disposing of them. But I must say, you are a remarkable specimen. Those Pokemon have nothing to do with you, do they? But still, you came to rescue them out of pity. Such pitiful and useless emotions. It's illogical and irrational. Pity and compassion are products of the weak and faulty human heart. You were compelled to come here by such vacuous sentimentality. I will make you regret paying heed to your heart. If you're wondering why I'm reading him in such a monotone, he's come across to me as kind of like he doesn't he's tr he doesn't really show emotion. So I don't know if that. I mean, I show a little bit, but he's come across to me as he doesn't show really. Can you hear me now? Yes, I can. Okay, I had to turn off my mic audio and just turn off the microphone or and turn on the microphone through my laptop. I don't know why my mic just stopped working. I was sitting here trying to talk to you and I'm not getting any feedback through my headset at all. That's weird. I, it's never happened before. I don't know why it's doing it. Um so I know it's done it once before. Oh my god, it just turned back on. <laughs> what the heck? Hold on. Let me let me try to change it back. It, it it's done this once before where it went on, but then I just like reset. I just unplugged it and it came back on. Yeah. So. Is it working now? Yeah. What the, what the heck? I don't understand. It like went out and it wasn't responding at all. Because normally when I talk in my headset, I can hear myself a little bit. Yeah. Like, I can hear myself talking through my oh own my mic. Oh my god, that was scary. Oh. That electro just used explosion. Ooh. That Thank is a God scary. Pride is bulky. Oh, I'm going to Tay for now. Yeah. Yeah, I'm because... sorry that happened. I don't I don't know why my mic went out. I was I was getting mad. I was like, come on man, I have a good headset. Like it shouldn't be doing that. Oh, paralysis on the second body slam. Awesome. Nice. And then I get paralyzed because of static. The reason I put Tay out is because grass is resistant to electric, so. It's not doing much damage at all. Yeah. And I defeated him. I see. You are indeed strong. And the basis of your world of your power is your compassion toward Pokemon. How wasteful. Such emotions are but mere illusions. And, like all illusions, they fade over time until death banishes them forever. That is why I have abandoned all emotions as useless sentimentality. That right there kind mm. of confirms to me that he's at, tries to be absent of emotion, if that makes sense. Yeah, why you read his voice the way you do. Yeah, but that doesn't matter. I doubt you will ever understand my position. That said, I recognize that you are strong and courageous to come alone. This is your reward. So you give us a Master Ball? The Master Ball is the ultimate Pokeball. It will unfailingly catch any Pokemon in the wild, but it is not anything that I require. Unlike you trainers, I do not make Pokemon my friends or partners. 
Unlike other Team Galactic members, I don't use Pokemon as tools. Instead, I make the power of Pokemon my own. If you wish to save the Pokemon from the lakes, take the warp panel ahead. I am off to Mount Coronet. I will ascend the mountain to its peak where destiny awaits me. It is there that I will create my own world, or my new world. And I believe this one just kind of takes you to, yeah, the stage where he was talking to people. And... Yeah, and this, once we are done with the rest of this, we can go back down there. Sweet. <laughs> yeah, we yeah, just get the that. master ball, and then you find a pokeball. Yep, it's because I have random items. I randomize the items. Oh, uh, okay. Can you stop moving, please? I feel awful about what we did. This experiment went too far. I'm not sure if I can stomach what Master Cyrus plans. I'm trying to read a nerdy voice. I'm not very good at it. I, that's probably what I would have read. Like, Earth, I feel too sickened to say anything. But that thing we made, what is it going to be used for? She's talking about the red chain, I believe, right? Oh, I should probably heal my Pokemon before I go into any more battles. Yeah. Just use up super potions, because they oh, don't need wrath. You don't need any health. Quit Fly, trying to steal bitch. the like, super potion. What? Fly, bitch. Yeah. It just makes me laugh every time I see it. Why? Because it's a Rayquaza? Yeah. Fwiahaha! <laughs> These Pokemon of the lakes, where do you suppose they will go? What are you trying to say? Nothing. Pay it no heed. A new world isn't overly interesting. What of it? If Cyrus is right, then Team Galactic will rule out a new world. That's when it will be interesting. A chance to enjoy its sweets. I surely hope that our visionary Cyrus realizes his dream. I look forward to whatever our beloved leader has planned atop Mount Coronet. Gramps, our boss can do without your kind of moral support. Oh, I did the same voice for both people. Whoops. <laughs> you! You came all the way here just to save some Pokemon? Though, it's nothing new. I can't say I understand our boss. Why would he let a kid like you come and go freely? We, Team Galactic, take all that we need and eliminate what we do not. But anyway, you've taken the trouble to come. Let me welcome you. Consider it payback for your insulting me at the lake. I believe he's the one we fought at the lake with all the weird flopping Magikarp. Yeah, I think he was. Um, Razor Leaf? Ooh, Zen Headbutt. Oh, ow. Razor Leaf. Goodbye. That did a good chunk, though. Uh, yeah, I'll switch to Gluttony. And I think a Water Pulse will be enough to take out, yep, four times effective. Uh, I'm not learning Screech. <laughs> <laughs> Bonsley. I think he must have a Rock-type team in this randomizer. Kind of like Cyrus had an electric type team. Aqua Tail. I believe... Mm -hmm. I did not teach Aqua Tail because Water Pulse can confuse. Aqua Tail is just 90 damage, 90 accuracy with 10 PP. Surface the same thing with 100 accuracy. Hits all opponents and has 15 PP. Yeah. So. I'd rather have... The, I like Water Pulse. I like the con chance for confusion. Yeah. Gah! What makes you so tough? Fine, do whatever you want with the those three Pokemon. Press the button on that machine to set them free. I like how he just lets you do it. It's like, alright, all my plans. Here you go, you can foil them all. <laughs> yes. Our boss crafted a red chain from crystals he took from the three Pokemon. That red chain is what he needed to shackle something on Mount Coronet. It's also apparently needed to create something. But that's all I know. Who knows what he's planning to do up there? Okay. So this is a little longer episode than normal because we kind of put a little bit it a little bit on a hold because we didn't know what was going on with Taylor. Sorry! I didn't mean it. No, it's okay. The last one I was in was long too. Yeah, it's not quite as long as that. That one was like over 50. <laughs> yeah, that's true. But, um... When I originally recorded this, it was like 37 minutes, so it's not that much different. 
Yeah, it's not too bad. But and uh, you know, I mean, we did just go through a big chunk of heavy storyline, so. Yeah, exactly. But then we're gonna go through more once we go to Mount Coronet. So. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and heal my Pokemon. Um, my question of the day has, is the same as it has been for over ten episodes, just because I haven't really received any comments on it. Um, it's pretty much, and because I don't have, I still don't have a six Pokemon for my party. I'm almost done with the series, and I haven't caught a six Pokemon for my Hexlock. <laughs> oh, uh, but, uh, yeah. I probably should have caught that Steelix I found a couple episodes ago, but I was looking for a Flying-type Pokemon, and I didn't really think that I could just... I didn't think of just catching a fly bitch until John mentioned it. So... <laughs> yeah, that's true. Because Steelix would have been really nice. Cause yeah, that... it would be bad. I, I don't remember what the Elite Four is like for this game. It's going to be different because of the, um, the randomizer. randomizer but, yeah. Um, it is... there. I know there's the fire-type guy that has a Lopany. I don't know if that got corrected in Platinum. Um, and there's a bug-type guy, I think. And uh, Cynthia's the champion. Mm-hmm. But we... We don't know if Cynthia's going to have a um, Garchomp, because it's going to be randomized, so... Yeah, forgot. But if she does have a Garchomp, Weavile. Yeah. Avalanche. Bye. <laughs> I would hope. Yeah. But, um... Yeah, go ahead and leave your suggestions for my last party member. Hopefully I find something good before the end of this, because I think... I mean, I'm going to end up having to catch something eventually. I just don't want to double up on types. I should have cut that Steelix, but um, just leave suggestions for either like party, either specific Pokemon or types. Hope, but preferably not like um, duplicate types. Um, but yeah, if you like the video, leave a like. If you're a first-time viewer, please subscribe. And this is Tiamat Ruler and Oh, well, Jake Rita signing out. And I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Peace. Bye.